someone like me who's been here since the very first day, um, all the planning as well, it's been it's wonderful to come back on site from time to time. Uh, quite often, if you see me up the town, you'll see me peering through the uh, holes in the wall to keep up to date with it. But it's it's really exciting. Tell us a bit about what when this is finished. At the moment, as lovely as it is, it's just a lot of muck and metal in the holes in the in the floor. I mean, what's it going to turn into? Well, it's going to turn into a superb venue, not just as a theatre. Um, it is going to replace the old Civic Centre. It will be available. All the seating, all the stall seating in the new theatre can be stored underground so that you can come back to a flat floor, a uh, huge flat floor. You've also got the smaller theatre um, and com rooms at the back which will accommodate about 200 people. The main theatre will be 1,200 in the seated mode, 1,800 if they're standing. This year it will be the, the, the sound um, pit uh, for, the, for the, uh, the new theatre. We're actually standing in the main auditorium, the seated area, and behind me will be the orchestra pit which they're currently working on, and behind that, behind the two gentlemen standing up there, just behind that is the back of house lift. So things are progressing. Are you uh, looking forward to the finished result? I mean, it's quite fun to come down here, but... Oh, extremely so, yes. I can't wait to be here for opening night. I really can't. Right, now I want you to look round and work out your exact location, because in 2010 or whatever, on opening night, I want us to be stood in exactly where, chairs pending, uh, we are now, OK? Is that a deal? Um, if I'm still in post, I'll... I'll, I'll... <laughs> I acknowledge that deal, yes. We'll be right next to the sound sound desk. Sound desk. How does that suit you? Lovely. And by the way, that is the middle of the theatre as well, so perfect seats. <laughs> when will it be finished? 2010, 2011 uh, are the more realistic options at this time. But I'm still very, very hopeful that the theatre will open by Christmas uh, of next year.